Hello YouTubers. This video slide shows you how to make your own three wire ground trailer connection for the lights connect to a four wire ground uh, system to a 2010 Honda Civic. Uh, I'm using a couple of uh, relays from Radio Shack that are single pole double throw relays and uh, you can also put these diodes on there or leave them off it's up to you I, I chose to put them on but you have to observe the polarity the uh, the narrow band goes towards the positive and the the darkest part of the diode goes to, to ground this slide shows a picture of a the connector, it's got a piggyback uh, connector for a uh, U-Haul rental, which is not connected to the trailer. And uh, <clears throat> I'd like to be able to, to use it with a U-Haul trailer if, if need be. But you can see that it has a, uh, a white ground, a brown wire for the running lights, a yellow wire for the... Uh, the pass the tr the driver side and a green for the passenger side wire. Think of it as uh, green for grass, yellow as the center line at uh, the no passing line on the driver side uh, to keep these wires straight in your mind. I did a lot of searching on the internet and uh, I saw these adapters and they were kind of expensive. So being of electrical uh, engineering background I decided to just uh, make my own adapter and I decided the easiest way would just go to Radio Shack and buy part uh, 2750248 uh, two of these they handle a 10 amp load and have a 12 volt coil so here's the front side of the package this is a picture of the back side of the a relay package and it shows the pin configuration uh, I simply took the two of these the one for the driver and the passenger side and put some uh, silicone between them so that the coils were in the upper left hand corner uh, you can do however you like but that's what I did and here's how to connect the little circuit that I drew up. Uh, the brake light is connected to the normally closed on both relays. It's common on top and the two two uh, relays common at the bottom go to either side uh, of the, the bulb and the normally open side of each side, the yellow and the green, uh, energize the coil and provide uh, voltage to the common, the same bulb, uh, the trailer light, uh, whenever the turn signals are are on. So it's basically a pretty uh, pretty simple circuit for something that puzzles a lot of people, I'm sure. A access is gained to the back of the Honda through uh, by moving removing this pin and uh, folding the, the material out uh, on either side. Uh, I chose to use the tail light and the turn signal and brake light on the left side and just the turn signal on the right side uh, for this application. You may have to uh, adapt for different vehicles. I apologize for the blurry picture. Uh, there's one wire going to the signal uh, bulb and there's uh, two wires going to the uh, brake light and tail light uh, bulb. Uh, I only had brown wire, uh, so I just put a piece of red tape on the on the brown wire that goes to the to the brake lights, so I can identify the which one's which. I chose to use a pill bottle to. Uh, to keep the whole uh, relay project inside uh, of something that protected it from 
shorting shorting out um, and blowing fuses. Uh, you do all this at your own risk, of course. And uh, uh, good luck. Just use common sense. I just drilled a hole in the bottle of this pill bottle, shoved the uh, four wires from in the from the vehicle into it and uh, tied a knot in it and then I added a fifth wire for the ground. When you view this slide just uh, tilt your head a little bit to the left and get that uh, diagram on the back and you'll see that uh, uh, the pins uh, configuration lines up. The uh, brown wire with the uh, red tape on it is uh, for the brake and it has a piece of uh, uninsulated wire uh, connecting it to the same re, uh, <clears throat> same point on the uh, normally uh, normally closed uh, connection, the, the the two ground wires are connected with the uh, white wire that has uh, the insulation on it that uh, crosses over the 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 uh, brake light uh, wire uh, to keep it from shorting out. Uh, the uh, the trailer connection isn't uh, shown on this uh, in this picture. You can see the two pins sticking up that are not connected yet. In this slide you can see the uh, green wire for the passenger side and the yellow wire to the uh, driver side uh, turn signal are connected. In this slide I, I show the uh, wires from the trailer. The uh, brown wire with the white tape on it is uh, the ground wire and the rest are just color-coded properly. Here's a picture of the uh, relays already shoved in the pill bottle. I drilled a hole in the lid and uh, shoved the trailer portion in there and uh, it's just uh, kept up with the or tied, tied up with the uh, tie wraps in the trunk to keep it from flopping around. The Honda Civic has a uh, ground lug connection for all the wiring uh, right on the left side of the trunk uh, when you when you open up the trunk and uh, I chose to solder it there. Uh, just to make mention that uh, this is for a light duty trailer. It's If you have a lot of lights you'll have to probably go go find on eBay something uh, a couple of single pull double throws that have handle more current and make sure you use a wire suitable to handle that current. Just to show that it works uh, I've got the wires connected and I'm testing the left turn signal. Of course this is a still slide so you can't see it blinking. And the right side blinker works as well. And the running lights work as well. And to keep the pigtail uh, for the trailer light out of the weather, I just stuff it in the trunk. And whenever I use it, I, I pull it out of uh, the trunk and close the lid on it and connect it to the trailer. And that keeps it nice and clean out of the weather. Uh, thank you uh, for watching the YouTube, and uh, I wish you uh, much success with uh, all your little projects. And I hope this was helpful. Uh, you can let me know uh, any comments. Uh, I probably won't answer. <laughs> uh, good luck. Bye-bye.